I think my desire to share classical music is just the most natural thing. There's nothing fancy or pretentious about it at all. It's just literally like you have a plate of great food in front of you and you want to share it with the person next to you or you want someone to taste it. We have some very, very, very special musicians who've come from very far away to uh, play for you. You know from where they've come? They've come from Scotland. Do you know where that is? Do you know where London is? Yes. It's close to London. <laughs> the first piece we're going to play is called Meditation. So we're going to play something very slow and very calm and very peaceful. So I want you to all to relax and maybe even close your eyes if you want and just allow your imagination to think very peaceful thoughts, very calm thoughts. Okay? I think with classical music, when you've spent that long getting to know something that great and you feel like the heavens have opened for you and that something has just taken you into a world of optimism that you never knew was there, it's just such a phenomenal feeling. I would like to give people the chance to feel that about classical music. This is the first time we've had something for them, like which was just pure music. But something like this was really wonderful because you know, they really got a good exposure to different type of instruments, which was a learning experience for me as well. Do all of you know what this instrument is called? Anybody know this instrument? Very good. They're symbols, like how we learn the English alphabet. Like that, they're symbols, they're music symbols. So it's like a language, you have to learn it. I'm sure that you know with the children's reaction they said that you know music has really touched their lives. I think this is going to be like a really lifelong experience for them.